At the dawn of 2020, I was not in a very good place. The world hadn't even collapsed under global catastrophe yet, but me personally, I was not happy with really anything. I didn't feel fulfilled with anything, just this loser trapped in meaningless existence. Despite this, I decided to try something new. Something I'd thought of for a long time, but never attempted. I had done a little guide in Stormblood, a text document of when and why AoE is good. It was simple, rudimentary, but right to the point. Originally, I planned to redo this for Shadowbringers, but never did. I decided to use the copy of Vegas Pro 15 I got for 20 bucks out of a Humble Bundle. I'd start with my main, a job I became extremely proficient in, and go from there. This decision essentially changed my life. Today marks two years since I released the first video in my 1 to 80 series. If you look at the Shadowbringers Guides playlist, you'll notice that a different video is in there. I grew much within my first year of guides, so much so I wanted to do my main job better than I did the first time around. Smooth things out, be cleaner, better audio balance. Even compare it further to the new Endwalker guides, and the difference two years makes is astounding. In that two years, I've also amassed nearly 50,000 subscribers. Thousands of supportive comments and millions of views. I even got my first real shout-out by Misshapen Chair. I genuinely feel an immense imposter syndrome in this space. I'm not some god-tier player, I'll likely never be good enough for world first prog, or week one tier clears or anything like that. And yet I was deemed worthy of a mention. Kind of might finally be pushing through to me that I'm not worthless. That I'm worth being seen this much. And that I'm seen this much is scary. I don't think most people really realize what it's like to have any sort of parasocial relation to the internet. Some people really go in wanting to be famous, to look cool. Others just luck into it, thrust into a situation they never really thought possible. And that's me. I never expected more than a couple thousand views for each guide. Some people take your existence as an excuse to insult the existence itself call you the worst things beyond what you might even normally see them call people. I'm this random guy on the internet and I'm mildly visible. That somehow gives them complete freedom to call all your work worthless, insult you as a person, and completely ruin your day, which has happened a lot. All these positive comments, all the support, and yet I can wake up one morning, read a singular attack, and be ruined for the day. If it was just normal criticism, what a video did wrong, or how I might improve, it'd be easy to handle. But I suppose nothing about internet fame is normal yet, especially to me, the apparently famous one. Maybe one day I'll find my groove in this, until then I'll just keep doing what I'm doing, and try to be proud of what I've done. I suppose that's my 2022 resolution, and so you may also see that first guide along with this one in your subscription box. I've re-released it to acknowledge how far I've come, and how far I can go. If it's not in your sub box, check the description if you want to see it. Watch it purely for a historical purpose kind of thing. I'll be sure to keep ads off of it since that's how I want it to be seen now. A historical look into me as a creator. I'm big on archival and this is likely the most important piece I'll ever keep around. Thank you all for bringing me this far. It is so very, very scary knowing so many people are watching, so many of you. How you might let people down and it be felt by so many. But I hope to keep earning your support, earning your views, and just... Thank you. This two years has been a very wild ride. And the only way I was able to get this video out without being 20 minutes of rambling by is by scripting it. Because even just writing this has been emotional. Here's to hopefully so much more. More Final Fantasy XIV expansions, maybe beyond fourteen as well. I do stream and all that, discords, all that good stuff down below. We'll see what the future holds, including Summoner's video on Wednesday, if you've been watching out for that.
take care, and may the power of an Anidhogs, and that's one singular Anidhogs with an S, lay waste to your enemies.